Hello guys, this is Thomas, and today I'm going to be doing another episode of Kerbal Space Program, just... Oop, what did I do? I'll fix that. So I'm just going to... Yeah, that's everything almost right. Let me just fix that little problem that I just made. No, everything's... I placed it right back. Okay, so today I'm going to be trying... Well, I will be trying to... Go to Minmus and back. Last thing I need to do is add a parachute, because if I forget that when I'm coming back, it'll be a lot harder to get back. I see a lot will be able to work. Okay, so I have tested this thing out. I got to Minmus and I was not able... I did not get back, so... But I just realized something. I'm going to add landing struts onto Lys, because last time I made with all of Lys to Minmus, this whole upper couple stages, okay? So I'm just going to add landing in this stuff. Three, can I fit that anywhere? Good. Oh, wrong place, down here. Um, is that going to fit? Which one of these is longer? I'm going to find that out too. Yeah, it looks like that's the longest, um... Well, I'm still going to have to be very careful with landing. And I'm also... So, I'm just going to launch this thing now. And... Hopefully I'm not going to go crash into the Minmus or the moon. Because last time I did... Last time I did have problems with the moon getting in the way. So, hopefully I won't have that problem this time. And so I'm also... My next goal after this is going to be able to get some Minmus, Lamoon, and Lin back, but that's going to take a lot of a bigger rocket, so that might be a while, but that's my next goal. And I kind of copied the idea from the Kerbal X rocket where no matter what, these inner stages are going to be full while these are burning off all their stuff, so I'm just going to turn on Autosass, or SAS, or whatever you want to call it. Oh yeah, and the top stage is a bit wobbly, so I'm just going to launch it at that stage. That was a little loud for me for a second. And now I'm on my way to Minmus. I'm just going to keep going straight up, and I'm going to... Yeah. Oh yeah, because I'm moving with the planet. Okay, so the hardest part about this is going to be getting my alignment right. But hopefully I won't have too big of a problem with that. I'm sorry if I'm recording at a bit low of an FPS, because I haven't gotten any upgrades for my RAM, I'm working on getting lows, but until then I'm going to be stuck with like 15 FPS with big rockets. Like right now I'm just about 12 FPS, but it's probably going to be a bit hard to notice right now, unless I zoom out, then with all of that you'll be able to notice. Ooh, reflections. And those outer rockets are done with. I thought at least middle ones up. Yeah, it's not quite as wobbly as it was last time. It was very, very, very wobbly. Now I'm just going to try to stick below about 250 meters per second, which is a. I know 100 meters per second is about 150 miles an hour. I think. I, I'm not sure. I can't remember. But. So I should be going at about. Let's say round up to 300. That's 450 miles an hour. That's a little bit. When when you think about it, how high the like how high the um how high the atmosphere is compared to how small the planet is, the planet must be very 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 dense, like denser than anything we know of right now because that's how small it is. And now that I got rid of those lower stages, which are way down there, 23 kilometers below me, falling. Or is that something else I left on the launch pad? I don't know. That's... meh. Well, still, I'm now I'm getting about 16, 15 FPS, compared to, like, a little less. After I get rid of this next stage, I should be getting a lot better FPS.
but I'm going to try to get the orbit onto that so it'll be very easy to line up with Minmus. Now the goal of this first rock is just to get me out. Very far out. Okay, let's see how um Okay, I'm just gonna increase that by a lot. Ooh, 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 I forgot this rocket does not control at all without the engines on all the time. Because of the fact that I only have one with thrust vectoring. Which I probably should have changed that, but nah. I don't like it, it's spinning now. Yeah, so I'll just look and see a slayer. And I'm just gonna get a little farther out than the moon, kill all of my velocity. Hmm. Just, nah. I don't know why it's not locking onto that, but it, it'll work. And so, I'm just going to keep flying my rocket straight up. Will it work now? Yes, it does. Okay. I have no clue what any of these mean to me. They probably don't mean anything right now that I really need to know to fly rockets to Minmus. Oh, yeah, my, out my outer stage rockets were done. Well, that explains why they weren't very going up. I wasn't going up very fast. I'm having a kind of hard time getting out there. I think I should have gone into orbit instead of just flying straight up because I would have been able to line it up better then. But mm, still, it, it'll work. Now I'm about. Oh, there goes the rest of my pieces that are flying down and while I'm boosting up. So I know this thing can get to Midmiss. I'm just not. T I'm just not completely sure if I can get it back. Especially since Min misses at such a long orbit. And also launched at near close to the best time to line up with this. Let me see what this does to my... Cause I, I'm trying to get that out close to the line as I can. Ooh, so now I'm good, almost. Okay, so now I'm a lot closer. I just need to move that up more vertically, and I should be right on this axis. I think it's north that I need to go. It is north. Okay, let's just... Whoa, what am I doing? What's going on? Okay, so now I just need to boost back up again, and I should be pretty much not on course for Minmus, but on my way. I think I'm, go I'm going to be there with a lot less fuel since I used... Last time I did use the moon, even though it did get in the way a lot, I used it to gravity slingshot my way up, and that helped a lot with getting out. But hopefully... I'll Last time I got, I was in orbit around Minmus with all of these. With only a fraction of the fuel left low, but hopefully I'll be able to do it with not quite as much left. Because I was very lucky last time. Whoa, moon, why are you getting away? Ooh, can I... Can I just get an encounter right now? Is that possible? Moon, stop getting in the way. No one loves you. Wait, so I can't... Well, I'm lucky. Okay. I did not have any of this planned out, so... I wish I could, though. I wish I could say that I had any of this planned out right now. Because I'm flying away from... Kerbal... No, Kerbin? Kerbin. Kerbal is the sun. No, I don't know whether I'm going there on my way back or on my way to. I'm gonna guess on my way back, so... 
and it seems to be a very short one if I don't crash into it. Fast forward a little bit more, and uh, I almost completely screwed that up. No, 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 no. I very much screwed that up that time. <coughs> well, I can't say, since I had n absolutely none of this planned, I can't even say that this was going anything, of any of this was going to happen. And yes, I did screw this up, but eh. I should be getting it into an orbit soon. There. Let's pull that down. And the high, I know the highest thing on Minmus is about 5,800 meters, maybe 5,700. So I'm just going to put myself into a nice little orbit around Minmus. Let's see how much fuel I have left. Oh, that should be right about enough to land on one of the lakes of salt or whatever. Because it's too close to the sun to have I don't know that's all I'm hearing is maybe it's salt or something because with no atmosphere it has no temperature regulation and it would I don't know like boil or something I mean not boil it would just completely disappear off the surface if you can't tell I don't really know that much about Minmus just about how high it is and that stuff and now I'm going to go to my, um, retrograde, I think. Yeah, I think. So, then I'm going to burn there, lower my orbit, and wait till I'm above one of the lakes. Or, at least, flat areas. And then I should have a very easy time getting to Minmus. I really need to watch about watch out that one. I had close enough. I'm at a really weird orbit. I guess I might as well try here. Okay. So I'm going to have to tinker a bit to make me land in that one place because it might be a little while till I get another opportunity, another good opportunity. So how much time do I have? I have enough time. Oop, no, that's the wrong direction. I wonder why my auto sass isn't working. For some reason it's doing this sometimes. Then it just blinked on there and I wasn't even close to pressing it. Okay, let's see if I can get myself to land into a little place. About right there seems good, okay. Where am I going? Oh, I'm close. I am close to the ground. I am very close to the ground. I didn't know I was this close. So I'm heading right around behind my ship right now. <coughs> and when I get so and so close, I'm going to just burn completely retrograde, and I should, oh, I'm almost out of fuel. How much do these even have any fuel left? They do not. That is why I was going even slower. Just burn a little bit out of them, because I do not want to crash into them, because that would be very bad. No, ship, stop going out of control, I don't like that. Especially when I'm so close to the surface. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, am I, am, I'm close enough. Close enough. Okay, I'm going to kill all of my velocity. At least all my horizontal velocity. Okay, I probably should have put at least a little RCS fuel on this. Let's put down my landing gear. It, it still looks like I'm very far up, but I'm still, I'm only like a few, 
thousand meters off the ground. I'm traveling pretty fast too. So I was very lucky that time because I did not have to, I didn't have to do anything. So Ooh now it jumped to surface, okay. Just gonna lock onto that. Go a little bit faster. Yeah, now I need to burn a little. Joshua, go away. You're blocking there's Bob. Bob Kerman. Last time I had Bill testing this and he said he had to die, but hmm. And now I can see the surface, so I need to start very slowing down. There goes my other things, right over there. I never name any of my things, that's just something I realized. Oh, I'm not going to be able to land on these, I guess. Oh, I should have got longer landing gear or something. So I'm going to have to go very slowly down because of how close this is. So... Hmm, only a couple hundred meters off the ground. It doesn't look like that low. Looks like I'm a couple thousand. But then again, you have to realize how small this thing is. I'm gonna start breaking even more now. Because I have no, my landing gear won't do me much good, apparently, because I put it on too high. Even though I couldn't really put it on any lower. Okay, sorry if I was a bit quiet there, but I'm using all my con- no, 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 I'm using all my concentration just to keep this rocket from plowing into the ground and flipping over because then it's useless. No, I was on the ground, I was on the ground, I was on the ground. No thrust back up, I can't, I can't do that. A uh, rocket, why are you so wiggly? Please, please, please. No, I need to thrust back up. Okay. I lost complete control. It's going to take it's gonna take me more fuel to land on this than it is to get me back to Kerbin. Let me just stay above 18 meters off the ground. Okay, now I'm back aligned again. Did I do it? Did I do it? I think I did it. But that little bit of SAS torque. Uh, looks like it's going to tip. Okay, well, I'm not even going to take Bob out in fear that he will not be able to get back in because of it tipping over. All three of my landing gear aren't doing me any good. Those, those will, because that has a really small engine. But those aren't doing me anything. So I landed on this with so little fuel left that I can get all the way back probably with this whole lower stage. Yeah, I'm gonna get Bob out. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Oh, that was a crazy thought there. Okay, so I'm just going to th throttle up just a little bit and I'll go all out. Oh, I should have screw it too late. 
I was going to say I should have thought which side was facing Kerbin, because I'm going away from it now, I realized that. But, yeah, I have enough fuel. I'll be able to get back easily. And this might even be my... Whoa, 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 slow down, slow down, slow down. Okay, let me just speed up a little bit. And I should be able to go back very soon. Okay, now I'm going to go to my retrograde, which I think is this way, and I will just break. That is all that will happen, because I am very lucky. And Bob will go be able to go back and work again, once again, without having anything terrible happen to him. I don't want to go to Minmus again. Because <laughs> after you're in the right, um, angle, and it's very easy to get to any of the planets, but that angle is also... No, I do not... Do I want to go? No, I don't want to go to the moon. Okay, I will crash into Curb, Curbin, Curb, get Curbin right now. Let me just speed this up a little bit. I don't like to use that last one because that last one is a lot faster. Okay. Question is where I'm, am I going to land? I have no clue. <coughs> yeah, I'm going to have to actually burn and get myself into a very tight orbit to try to land on the same continent as I did, as I took off from. Okay, close enough. Uh, I'm al almost one kilometer of Delta V. I really have no clue how much delta V this rocket has, but it it is a it's a large enough amount. Am I going to land on that continent? I have no clue. Oh, I will! Yay! At least I think I will. Well, either way, I have to go back to facing upward, so I can be able to thrust back up without exploding anything. Actually, I'm just going to deploy my parachute right now. Deploy shoot. Because I might be able to land with everything, with this whole stage. And either way, I'm going to go put this on, and go and send out this rocket design for you people who either want to copy me and say Clem says that's their own credit, or who just want to go and try to get to Minmus and back. Which, because that's not a very, it's not an easy task, but not a, it's not the hardest task there is. Even though Minmus, I think, would be one of the easiest planets to go to, because with the moon, it has a higher gravity, and Minmus has a lot of flat areas, and most of it's, but then again, it is a lot rockier in some areas, and... Okay, I'm oh I'm traveling fast. I'm going to get re-entry effects at a major scale. I'm going so fast. This would kill everything that was on board if I was truly going this fast. I'm no I'm not I'm not even going to waste any fuel because I can probably land with this one little tiny parachute and a little bit of thrust. Unless it just drips it apart, so yeah, I need I need to go faster. Yeah, I, I there's yeah I, I do need to go. I'm gonna thrust about right here so it slows my horizontal velocity, but mostly my vertical, because I'm traveling very 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 fast. Oh, I'm going fast. This is too fast. There, I might survive. Yeah, this last stage barely has any thrust, but has a better thrust over weight ratio than my other one. Ooh, just a little, just a little slower, just a little slower, because I know it bursts about 400. Oh, just slow down. 
That's all I'm trying to do. No, I need auto sass on. Yes, I did it. I am going back home and will most likely not explode now. I probably could have done it with that whole lower stage, but it would have been a lot diff more difficult than it would probably have just completely destroyed my craft. I think these parachutes deploy at 500 above normal, so, or so, so, it should be perfectly fine for landing. Oh, I'm going fast again. This throttle back up. Turn off my engine, and now I'm going in nice 12 kilometers an hour. Wait, so that's, yeah, this is a high place. I'm going to say it's about 600 meters, or yards, yeah, meters up. I'm just going to keep thrusting back up and turn on auto sense. Just, yeah, I'm getting very close. Let's slow that, let's slow that down even more. I did it. Two min miss back to Kerbal. Kerbin. Whatever. Yay. Yeah, do that dancing thing. Two min missing back. I know a, I know a lot of other people have gone to min missing back, but this is the first time I have gone to oh no, you did a face plant. Get back up. This is the first time I've done it. So I could probably got I could probably have gone to the moon too, but mm, still yay. Just do your little dance thing. I have no clue what I'm doing. Um, yeah, now he's out of his rocket. I'll have to bring someone here to get him back. But, for today, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, or just, I don't know, do anything. I, don't, I actually don't really have an opinion what you do. Just don't kill people, because that's not good. And, well, thank you for watching, and have a good day. Adios.